A great welcome to all our viewers all across the city to this new edition of the show that brings you everything you need to know about our world and its history. I'm your host, Phil, and this is how you know your world. On this edition of the show, I figure we should do something scientific. Fresh air. You just can't get enough of it. Now as most of us know, we all need air to breathe, and the air we breathe in is called oxygen. Now you might say, well Phil, that's kind of like an obvious statement, isn't it? Well, that's kind of true, but the thing is, did you know who discovered oxygen? The discovery of oxygen is still a debatable topic even in this day and age. One individual who discovered it was Joseph Priestley. He was an English chemist, theologian, educator, natural philosopher, and political theorist. He is credited as the first to publish his works and is famous for the soda water experiments and his prioritized discovery of deflogisticated air, otherwise known today as oxygen. Now that's only one part of the story. Another person who claimed to have discovered oxygen was a Swedish chemist named Carl Wilhelm Scheele. According to history, Scheele was known as the first person to discover oxygen sometime in 1773, though his work wasn't published until after Priestley published his work. When he first discovered oxygen, he called it fire air since according to him, it supported combustion or burning. History states that both Priestley and Scheele have their own claims to the discovery of oxygen. But who really came up with naming oxygen as an element? That is none other than Antoine Lavoisier. Antoine Lavoisier was a French nobleman prominent in the histories of chemistry and biology. He was the man who gave oxygen its name as an element. Taken from the Greek words oxys, which means sharp or acid, and genus, which means born or former. Now, like we usually learn in science class, oxygen by definition is a colorless, odorless, and tasteless gas, which means, yeah, we can breathe it, but we can't smell it. Well, that's all the time we have for our show today. I hope you gain a little more knowledge about oxygen. I'm your host, Bill, and this is how you know your world.